At 6.33, Governor Bob McDonald will sign off on tougher DUI legislation today, and he'll sign the new law in Virginia Beach. Down on your sides, Liz Palka joins us to explain more about the DUI crackdown and how it's expected to keep drivers off the road. Liz? Katie, this law means anyone who gets a DUI will have to have an ignition interlock placed in their car. That's a breathalyzer that the driver has to blow into in order for their car to start. Here's some video of what that device looks like. The driver's car won't start if their blood alcohol content is over 0.02. Virginia Beach Delegate Sal Iaquinto introduced the bill in the House. He says it took him six years to get this legislation passed. Several of the uh, criminal defense attorneys in the Senate were arguing that it might be um, a little bit of a cost to those people convicted of their first offense DUI. And my answer to them was, well, what's the cost of losing a life to someone who drives drunk? The device will cost a driver $80 per month. Virginia Beach's Commonwealth attorney Harvey Bryant is a supporter of the new law. He says Virginia joins 13 other states that have created ignition interlock requirements. And this is a ceremonial bill signing happening today in Virginia Beach. The law went into effect on July 1st of this year. Live in the newsroom, I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side. McDonald will sign the drunk driving legislation today at 3.30. The ceremony will happen at the Virginia Beach Fire and EMS Training Center on South Birdneck Road.